Hey you, this is Jasim from Code with me and in this video I'm gonna be showing you how to use or how to implement a custom manager and a custom query set in a model in Django. So if you are new to my channel, please do subscribe my channel and click the bell icon near to it. So without any further, let's jump right into it. All right, so what I have created here is a simple block boilerplate. You know, I have created a Django project, created a virtual environment and activated it. Then I have created a, a post application and I have added it in the settings.py in the installed apps. Then I have created a basic model uh, named post and uh, you just assume this as a block uh, post, uh, a simple blog post which has a title and a content and a created at timestamp and this is also uh, this has also the auto now add is equal to true so that when the object is first created uh, it just automatically adds the uh, the date time to it and it ha it has also the uh, string representation which returns the title itself and what i'm going to do is you know i have uh, created all the migrations and migrated those stuff and what I'm gonna do now is python manage.py shell. I'm just doing the shell, uh, opting the shell, and I'm just importing that model post.models import post import post. Now, what I'm doing is post.objects.all. I'm fetching all the objects. Now you could see a query set of you know all the all the five objects which I have created just uh, before. So uh, you could also create you know uh, just five or six you know objects for for the clarification itself. So uh, what we are gonna be implementing is you know uh, we need something like this one post dot objects dot all dot uh, order by order by. Uh, I want to get this in the descending order of created at so that I place a hyphen over here and if I do uh, click now I got it in the reverse order of the created at. So I have to implement this stuff, this very own stuff but with a custom uh, manager method and with a custom query set method. For example post.objects uh, dot sorted for example uh, dot sorted this method should return this stuff okay this stuff the same exact stuff okay but with this method the sorted method and also i want this is now the uh, manager method and uh, this one for post.objects.all.sorted this is the query set method and i want also this one to return the same stuff so instead of doing uh, the regular way, uh, I just want you know both these methods work. So this is a very basic example uh, to understand thing how things work. So uh, you know uh, if you know how all these manager methods and the query set methods work, then you could do pretty much everything oh, and uh, with its customizations. So uh, we are moving on to the project, uh, and the first thing. To note is that you know all the method has a, a default manager named objects, which is uh, which is nothing but the default manager that is the models dot manager. Okay, this one is what you know. If I do say post dot objects, this objects is this one, which is which we are we will not be writing because you know it already is uh, inherited from this models dot model. So this uh, object is objects is what is this one so i could simply say dot items sorry uh, the items itself then i could say post dot items and now this is the manager name okay so if i clarify that stuff in the shell i do exit from the shell and open it once again and I do the imports and all from post yeah this one now if I do say post.objects.all, it doesn't work because you know objects is now items. So I could say post.items here and it works. So that's the first thing to know. Now what we want to achieve is that post. Uh, 
I'm just renaming this back to objects uh, and what I want is ports post dot objects dot um, sorted okay this is what I want post dot objects dot sorted so now the default one the default manager doesn't have this sort method so what I want to do is I want to create my own manager which inherits from the default manager so I'm naming it as you know post manager I'm creating a class of post manager up here uh, class post manager and which inherits from models dot manager so that it gets all the default functionality so what I want to do is you know I want to create a method so this one is a method in the uh, in, in, in the in the uh, post manager that we have created so def sorted and what I have to return is you know this stuff you know this stuff in the sense uh, post dot items here in the shell it hasn't changed to objects because I need to reopen the shell so that this takes effect uh, so here uh, what I want to do is post dot objects dot all dot order by in the descending order of created it this is what I want at the end so what I want to return is you know I want to return self dot get query set dot order by and the same stuff created it I'll explain the code I'll explain what this one is the get query set now if you look into the manager the, the code of this models dot manager if I control click this one I do get this stuff and this is that class the default class which inherits from the base manager and the base manager is this one and here you could see a get query set method yeah this stuff this is the get query set method and this returns the self dot query set class meaning it returns a query set that is much like you know it returns uh, this stuff models dot uh, sorry post dot objects dot all it returns up to here then from there we have access to this order by method because it's a query set method uh, just like this one order by and uh, the same stuff is that okay so if I do uh, now save all those stuff and uh, uh, I just exit and reopen the shell and uh, make sure you import all those stuff and if I do now post dot objects dot sorted uh, then you could see you know created by uh, what's happening sorry it's created at sorry I'm very sorry for that it's created at so if you do this again uh, you know you have to uh, reopen the shell uh, for example you know you have to do the imports from post models and now yeah this one dot uh, sorted yeah now this works perfectly now you have access to this you know sorted method with the objects model sorry with the model manager so that's the first task we have accomplished now the second task is a very simple post dot objects dot all dot sorted and this all is nothing but the query set so I need to you know implement a query set method sorted now the default query set is in a models dot query set this is the default query set so this query set doesn't have this sorted method so what I want to do is you know add my own uh, query set uh, class so in order to do so we have discussed this get query set method over here so it, it says that uh, subclasses can override this method to customize the behavior of the manager so what I could possibly do is you know I could implement my own get query set here in the models manager get query set and what I'm uh, gonna return is the same exact same stuff this stuff and this stuff now instead of this self or query set class which is the default model start query set what I want to do is uh, do my own custom query set class so post query set and if I do um, uh, create that post query set here class uh, the same stuff class post query set and which in, uh, inherits from models dot query set so that it gets all the default functionalities and uh, now if you look into the query set code control plus click 
then you could see all the methods like you know create bulk create and filter and exclude on all those steps are there okay now here here in what you want to achieve at the end you want this post dot objects dot all dot sorted this is what you want so we are uh, up to here we have written up to here now which means up to here then we need this method sorted method so what you could possibly do is you know the same exact step what we have done in the manager we create a sorted method here and we just return self dot order by and the order by is you know created at in the descending order now what this step does is you know you have access to the models dot query set which has the method of order by much like here you know you could see um, Uh, you know this one you, you uh, this is what this up to this this stuff and you have access to the order by because you are inheriting from the query set okay so the order by is there now if we do uh, you know save all those stuff and um, if I exit from the shell and reopen it once again and do the imports and if I do say post dot objects dot all dot sorted then you could see the result okay so we have accomplished two tasks so uh, you know there is uh, a, a dry exception here do not repeat yourself we have repeated both of these methods so what we could possibly do is you know in this manager method I could simply say uh, self dot get query set and after this one now self load get query set will uh, uh, refer this stuff and in the post uh, it, it returns this post query set which is this one and it has a method of sorted so I could simply say dot sorted so this will refer you know this method and uh, that's it if I do check uh, exit from the console I'll open it again do the imports and if I do check now this stuff we got the result and I'm also checking the uh, manager method sorted and if I do check that yeah I go the same exact result so everything is working perfect if you have any doubts please do rewatch the video and if you have any doubts regarding you know all these methods you can uh, do a uh, comment it in the comment section and I'll help you and uh, that's it that's all about the video and if you haven't subscribed to, to my channel yet please do subscribe my channel and click the bell icon here to it so thank you for watching we'll see you in the next one